Hello. So why don't you talk? Why don't you talk normal, but just a little further away? Hello. That's too far. <laughs> I say a little. Hello. Is it good? Oh, oh no, God. good. <laughs> no, I don't know anymore, man. Like you're. <laughs> Hello everyone, welcome back to this episode of Yum Chat Chit Chat. My name is Sue. I'm Ken. And I'm Jenny. So for today's episode, we're going to do something a little different. We're going to be playing a game called Never Have I Ever. So have you guys ever played Never Have I Ever? Do you guys know the rules or? Never have I ever played Never Have I Ever. <laughs> 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 is that one of them? <laughs> is it is it is it a good one? <laughs> pretty good, pretty good. <laughs> yeah, that's good. <laughs> so the rules of this game is that we each have ten fingers. Um, well, duh. duh. <laughs> ten finger? What are you talking about? <laughs> I have eleven. Okay, so fuck <laughs> off. <laughs> I want to see that. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> anyway. So the rules of this game is that um, we each hold up our ten fingers, and what we would take turns saying what we have never done. And if you've done that event or if you've done that、um, action before, then you put one finger down. And the first person to put down all ten fingers loses. So the loser will be buying each of us boba. <laughs> Yay, boba over alcohol. <laughs> I know this is supposed to be a drinking game, but we don't have alcohol right now. Um, so let's start. So the first thing, let's start off pretty easy. The first thing I have is never have I ever need to wear prescription glasses. Oh my that's god, that's lame. <laughs> You're yeah, lame. We're starting off easy. That's- That's wow. Okay. Okay. One down. I, one down here. Yeah. I wear glasses too, but I only wear glasses when I um have to drive at night. I don't、uh, normally wear glasses or contacts. Yeah, I have glasses all the time since I was elementary. So. Okay, I'll go next. Never have I ever got a tattoo. <laughs> Hi, bye, Ken. <laughs> yeah. Oh my gosh. Okay. Well, this is so. I have a tattoo of a palm tree. Fireworks. <laughs> I swear to God, every single person who's seen my tattoo always thinks that it's a firework. I don't know why. But yeah, I got it in downtown LA with one of my college friends.、Um, it was actually like. Pretty interesting because the tattoo artist that I that we went to, his wait list is like a year, a year and a half long, and I was、mm-hmm. lucky enough for him to offer me this tattoo on the spot because my friend actually waited like about six six to seven months on his wait list, and then、mm-hmm. he had some free time before his next appointment, and then I was talking about how this was my first tattoo and I really wanted it, and then. Um. Yeah. He just he was kind enough to offer, but it was really expensive. I was、uh, really surprised too. Really... No, but I love it. I love I, it. I would I not re- regret any single second of it. I was really surprised、yeah. that the tattoo is that expensive, and then you told me it's a palm tree. <laughs> What's wrong with the palm tree? If、uh, you live in LA too, if we have a chance that uh we will post something on. About her tattoo, then we'll let people to see is it palm tree or firework. <laughs> let people.、Do. You want to tell that story, so you actually started to like why are we calling it fireworks? <laughs> oh, okay. So, well, palm trees are really special to me because well, we live in LA and there's a lot of palm trees here. And then I went to college in Santa Barbara and there's a lot of palm trees there as well. So when I look at a palm tree, it reminds me of like. Really beautiful views, and it just calms me down a lot.、Um, and I, when I graduated UCSB,、um, you know how people like decorate their graduation caps, right?、Mm-hmm. And so 
for me, I did a I did a palm tree, but <laughs> I showed it to I showed it to my mom, and then my mom was like, "Oh, that's so pretty! It's such a it's such a beautiful firework in front of all my friends." <laughs> And I was like, hmm, mom, actually, correction, this is a palm tree. She's like, oh, yeah, that's a beautiful palm tree as well. I'm like. <laughs> we should just show the audience one day. The picture of the your decoration cap and then and your tattoo to see that. Is it a palm tree or is it fireworks? No, I think my, my graduation cap, like, it already... I don't know where it is. I don't think I can find it, but we'll see. <laughs> we'll see. All right, okay, next. My turn. My turn. Oh my god! So I take off one. I try to take off both of you. I have. Yeah, I have nine. <laughs> I have. Yeah, same. Well, we all have nine. Never have I ever playing Candy Crush. Really? <gasps> what? No, I never. No I ne- way. I never played Candy Crush. I think that game is so stupid. Well, you're stupid. <laughs> you stupid. <laughs> Wait, I don't. Okay, so I don't really like playing that game because it frustrates me. But I've played it before. Like when I came, when it first came out, I've played it yeah. before. Like I think everyone played it before. I did not play that. I'm not a big I fan of puzzle games, so that's why I didn't play it. It's not because it's your trend. Uh, it's not because like people is not pop about the popular stuff. Because I just don't like puzzle games. Oh well, puzzle games train your brain. Not on you. No, <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> That's not true, Anna. I guess. Did it train your brain? <laughs> yeah, it did. Wow, it helps me think. I think you tend to pray more then. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck off. Interesting. Okay, so my turn. Uh, my second one is never have I ever been to Six Flags. Really? Mm-hmm. Six Flags? Yeah. Oh, okay. Why? Yeah. I I never been to Six Flags. Really? Either. Yes, oh. it's you. Oh, oh, yeah. Can't live here so so long. I haven't been in Six Flags. Yeah, I went to all the other big theme parks in California. Like I've been to Disney. Mm-hmm. I've been to Knotts. I've been to Universal. It's just not Six Flags because I don't mm-hmm. know, like. Ever since I was small, like I, I don't hate roller coasters, but I've seen videos of Six Flags roller coasters, like going going really high up and really like it, it's like really extreme. And then when I did want yeah. to go to Six Flags, I remember there was an incident of some kind. I don't know if it's in California or Florida, but like there was news that the the roller coaster was off Mm -hmm. track or something so ever since then i just did not want to go like i didn't have any desire to go to six flags yeah for me i'm just not a big fan of roller coasters so no thanks no but have you been to uh do you like california adventures um what is it called california screaming the disney one one? yeah this one the one that goes like three three sixty Oh, that one. Oh, that one's they change it. The, I know which one I talk about. Now they change it to uh the film is incredible. The dash. Oh, oh yeah. It's yeah. The, the dash the the kid that in the incredible who runs right, pretty yeah. fast. So you are you are just sitting in the in the ride, pretending you are dash, and then just run through oh. the whole ride. Oh, so you've 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 been there already. I've been like there. Oh. I went there last year, December. 2020 or 2019? 20, 20, 2019. Oh, yes. oh 2019. Sorry, 2019. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God, no. yeah. I it's know. Really <laughs> it's really updated. Oh, nice. Bad, no sex threat. You guys should go then. Yeah, I, I think it's great. No, no, thank you. No, it's okay. <laughs> but speaking of that, my next one is <laughs> never had I ever um, roll on the 360 roller coaster so jenny you didn't like to play right or or just like i do but i'm so afraid of like going 360 so i've never been on one that goes 360 but it's only like half of a second or quarter of a second that you're i know but i just like never okay like next time we can go or what about the one that goes up and down i hate up and down 
Really? I never been on those ones I ha- either. I hate those, oh, and like, cause you can feel um the force. Like you can feel the force and li- lifting, but the three sixty only feel that you are just upside down, but you don't feel any force because there's no speed at all. But I'm a, I'm fear those like those kind of like the drop kind of feeling. Like even on an airplane when you go through like turbulence, like when it like the pretty uh-huh. bad ones, I get scared. I can, I can tell you 360 you won't feel that one. Only you only those up and down where I can feel that one. I don't know. I just like never really a big fan of roller coasters. And then like the last couple of years I never really had a chance to go to like theme parks. So yeah. Never mind. After after everything we open, then we should all go to a theme park once. Yes, for sure but no six flag no six flag uh we should go six flag then we can take off that question next time too no 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 <laughs> no i don't no no thank you i don't want to go sorry six flag but i don't want to go i'm gonna go to disneyland disneyland yes we can go to okay disney. disney all right ken you're next okay never have i ever went 24 hours without showering 24 um, hours oh. i don't remember Hold on. I think I have. I think I have. Like, when I'm sick, I don't shower because I'm in bed all day. Mm, oh. Really? Wow. I thought you need to take a shower when you... No, because you if you're really me. sick, like, if you have chills and you have a fever, like, why would you go to shower? Isn't it going to get worse? Or I don't, you I don't even take a shower. have energy to shower. Because you... Oh. But when you have fever, then you're all... You're all sp- you are sweating, then if you take a shower, you make, make you more fresh. Then no, but when I sweat, uh, when I have a fever and I sweat, I just wipe it with the towel. Because if I sweat and I go into the shower, it might like increase the chances of me having a fever, or like to continuously to have a fever. Mm, okay, but um, you got me, Ken. I I did. The one I remember is because I was actually out 24 hours. <laughs> out 24 hours? What do you mean? Yes. It was pretty crazy. So I was in Singapore. I was there for study abroad. 